today I am going to do a little bit of a desk tour. I'm going to show you all around there and down there. But the reason why I did this because I mentioned in the last couple of videos that I was going to show you around and I feel like I've gained semi enough of a following that they would actually care to know what my desk looks like. So yeah, so let's start. First thing that I want to show you is my Copic area. I already did a video on this topic of all of my Copics that are inside of this bag. <laughs> it's my Copic collection, but yeah, I also have my Copic paper right here and I have my hex chart, my Copic charts and some scrap paper. Over here is where I place my phone. It's right here. And this whole contraption is sort of my tripod, but not really. Um, actually, what this is, is a couch footrest, sort of. Um, we have a black couch, and this is what well, we used it for, but I use it now. And actually, this is something that somebody asked me in one of my videos on uh, do I have a tripod or anything? And um, this is what it looks like. This is a lid to something. I'm not entirely sure what it is, but this is also a bean bag or a rice bag, as you would say. And that's right where, where I will place my phone that shines right down onto whatever I'm drawing. Moving along, this is my drawing area with all of my sketches and drawings inside of it. Also, if you want me to do a sketchbook tour, please put it in the comment section because I feel like that would be pretty fun, but I'm not going to do it unless you guys don't want me to. I mean, unless you guys want me to is what I meant to say. But yeah, so over here is where my paint, most of my paint supplies is. They, they, didn't, they don't have very much colors in here, but this is where my paint cap could be and this is where all of my paint brushes are. Um, but this is also where my pen is, my signing pen that I sign in all of my videos, aka also my old multi-liner <laughs> that isn't a multi-liner, it's just a pen, but yeah. So this is also just a little bit of an inspiration, something just to put on my desk, because that's nice. And this is a desk lamp that whenever I turn it on with this little knob thingy, it shines right down onto my paper, which is a great lighting for whatever my phone is right there shining down out of there so yeah right over here is where my watercolor set is I did one picture on it before but I do like this set and I do want to keep using it more often I just haven't gotten around to doing it because I just find copics more fun I guess this is my drying paintbrush rag I don't really know what to call it but I would use these two rags to dry my paintbrushes with if I needed to. And over here, right next to my desk lamp, is my custom made um, colored pencil case where red, orange, yellow, green, blue, violet, and other colors, skin tones, and blacks and grays. But I made this entirely out of cardboard, and that's what I did yesterday, and I spray painted it black. I think it turned out really, really good. Actually, I'm very proud of how it turned out. Um, I wouldn't, I didn't regret making it at all because it is very nice and it fits all of my colored pencils in perfectly. And I also was thinking about maybe eventually if I get more Copics, putting them in there instead of my bag. But, um, for now this works and I do want to also start using colored pencils more than I do. So moving on along is under my desk um you can see the little plug thing where my my desk lamp is and this is just where all of my art supply sets are i did a review of those also in my art supplies haul that i did of all my go-to art supplies over here is just random art supplies like crayons oil pastels and stuff like that over here is a little case of where well, it's not really a case. I don't really, I think it's laminated. Is that what you call it? Yeah, I think so. And then um, here's some cardstock under it if I want to do something that needs um, thicker paper. Over here is all of my drawings. As you can see, that's my cupcake that I did in the video and everything. Those are also some of my sketchbooks. And again, 
If you want to see what's inside of them, please comment down below because that would be really fun to show you. So thank you all so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it and would like to see more, please give it a like. Comment, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!